and a very warm welcome. I am Ruchi Sharma. Cryptocurrency markets fell most in about a week as hawkish rhetoric from Federal Reserve officials and further signs of an aggressive US regulatory clampdown stirred caution. Bitcoin dropped below the $24,000 levels. IC15 index of cryptocurrencies was trading down by 3% at 33,900 points. The PPI report captures what companies pay for supplies such as fuel, metals, lumber, packaging and so forth. US wholesale prices jumped 0.7% in January to mark the biggest gain since last summer, offering further proof that inflation is sticky and unlikely to decline rapidly. The increase in PPI index over the past 12 months meanwhile slowed to 6% from 6.5% in the prior month. However, this is still three times higher than the Fed's target for overall inflation. Excluding food and energy, the core PPI increased 0.5% compared with expectations for a 0.3% increase. Core excluding trade services climbed 0.6% against the estimate for a 0.2% rise. Meanwhile, the SEC has filed a lawsuit against Terraform Labs and its founder Do Kwon for allegedly orchestrating a multi-billion dollar crypto asset securities fraud. SEC Chairman Gary Gansler earlier alleged that Do Kwon and Terraform Labs committed fraud by repeating false and misleading statements to build trust before causing devastating losses for investors. In other economic data, the Labor Department reported that jobless claims edged lower to 194,000, a decline of 1,000 and below the market's expectations for 200,000. The global crypto market uh, capitalization was trading at $1.09 trillion, plummeting 2.5% in the last 24 hours. The total crypto market volume increased by 4% to stand at $80 billion. According to a Feb 16 Reuters report, an investigation of Binance's banking records and company messages showed that more than $400 million was sent in a series of transactions in 2021 from an account controlled by Binance US to trading firm Mer Merit Peak. As a result, crypto bank Silvergate Capital price shriveled by 22%. Market participants expect the Fed to increase interest rates a few more times this year, according to CME Group data, with the final or terminal rate ending around a range of 5.25% to 5.5% from its current 4.5% to 4.75%. US stock futures slipped after the major averages suffered declines amid concerns of stubbornly high inflation matrix. Dow Jones Industrial Average futures fell by 111 points or 0.33%. S&P 500 and Nasdaq 100 futures dipped by 0.5% and 0.8% respectively. Bitcoin was trading at $23,733, down 3.7%. Ethereum, the second largest crypto, was down by 1.5%, trading at $1,664. BNB was down by 4% to trade at $309. Solana SOL was down by 5% and was trading at $22.6. Avalanche AVAX was trading at $19, lower 4.4%. Cardano's ADA token was down by 3.3% to trade at $0.39. Doge, the popular meme coin, was trading down by 3% at $0.086. Shiba Inu was trading down by 4.7%. Ripple's XRP token traded at $0.38, down by 3%. However, Polygon Matic was trading up by 4% to trade at $1.4. Polkadot was up by 1.8% to trade at $6.7. That's all in Coin Monitor for now. This is me, Ruchi Sharma, signing off. Do like, share, and subscribe to 3.0 TV and have a great day.